everybody and welcome back to the channel. Um, today's date is the... What date is it, Johnny? The 9th of July. And we are up in Brittany. And we're at a lovely campsite that we so found on Search for Sites. Um, and I'm surprised that there was no reviews or no nothing on the um, search for sites. So we're the first people to leave a review there. And it's a lovely campsite. And it's called... Hang on, I want to show it to you. Val de Laundret. I'll put all the details on it, as you know, um, in the description below. And this campsite was only... How much for the night, Johnny? Uh, it was 50-something... How much for the three nights? 60, 69, Sixty-nine euro or something any for for, yeah, for the three nights. I think it was sixty-nine euro for the three nights. You know, which was wicked cheap, like um, with electric and there's free showers and um, free showers. Uh, there's a bar here uh, and there's a little restaurant here. And then we didn't eat from there. Uh, because we kind of got our own food kind of in um, Super in Super U because there's a Super U here and we were able to, um, you know, uh, cook up uh, stuff. 69 euro, yeah. 69 euro. Right, so that's this campsite. Uh, it's a, uh, you can kind of see we have our little barbecue out and clothes hanging out and we've done washing and all that here. But, um, you know, there's loads of... Uh, pitches and all that. We're in a nice shaded pitch. So yeah, there's our pitch, lovely and shaded. The, 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 you know, the shade now is fully across there. The sun is kind of coming around to this side now, so so um, we'll be hiding again in behind the camper, around the front of the camper. But yeah, this is it. Reception and all that is up there. I put a photo up there now of going into the reception and have to try and get around to show you the rest of the campsite. It's kind of a bit busy. But when we got here, uh, there's an air here as well, isn't there, Johnny? Uh, yeah, there's an air um, just outside the gate as well. It looks like, you know, it's a free air. Um, so it looks like anyway, but um, and it's not on search for sites or anything. There's a big, huge motorhome up there. Um, I'll try and, you know, if I could get up around there, I'll get out the bike and try and get up around there. Uh, but when we first arrived here, the sat -na the sat -na brought us in there. Yeah, yeah. yeah, instead of bringing us down in here. But um, we we were all right in the finish. Um, yeah, we're here for the three nights. Cause we're, we're going home now, the 19th of July. Um, and the weather has been good to us so far. Thank God, no thunder and lightning around. Because, yes, people that know me very well know I'm petrified of thunder and lightning. And I can't help it since I was young. When I was very young, when it was thunder and lightning, my mother would panic, and the same in the schools, that they'd be panicking. Um, teachers would be running around, turning off electric, and uh, Sister Sumter used to run through all the classrooms, and uh, of course, my mother, the same thing. Oh my God, to, to cover mirrors, uh, uh, plug out everything. So it's, <laughs> you know, and I'm the same. I, if I started thunder and lightning there now, I'd have to plug out that camper van and come out from underneath these trees uh, and not be the highest thing. Oh, my little things that they're blowing off. But, um, yeah, enough of that. Um, oh, oh, I, have to, I have to drop my little hairy, hairy mouse thing. If Massey saw it, he'd, he'd eat it and chew it up so he would. But, um, yeah, we must uh, show you around now, the campsite. So we'll be back to you in a bit. Right, so here we go, campsite tour. Right, there's all the pictures left and right of me. There was a tent stair to the right. Nice motor home here. I'll have a good old nose now. So we'll go over to the area where there's showers and toilets, but I won't go in there just in case there's people in there. camera now is, isn't jumping around the place but there's your toilets and showers and they are mixed 
as well, but they're nice and clean, and you clean your dishes in there as well, and clothes. So that's that in there. Right, loads of pictures to the, to the right of me as well. So we'll go up now to the, to the other place where there's motorhomes. Good few pitches, loads of pitches around here. Right, so other motorhomes are up here. I'll take us at I'll take a little cycle in there for the nose. More pitches, all electric. Little lights in the night time as well. English camper to the left of me. Nice barbecue area in the middle there. Don't see where the water is, there's the bin. Uh, now I'm going to take you out to the air. And bring you around, down around the front part of the campsite. So out here is the air. Don't know if I'll be able to get out this way, will I? Hang on now, I'll get off my bike and walk out. Because this is where we were brought in first. So it was. Um, it's all to do with the campsite as well. Indoor, indoor tennis and that. But there's the air, as you can see. There's the motor homes. There's the motor homes. And to the left of me is, is, oh Jesus, is uh, uh, your services for the air. Okay, where am I going now? Where am I? Hang on now, because I don't know where I'm going. Jesus. Just go down this way. Jeez, there must be something on today. Oh my God, huh? Hang on now, lads. Because I wanted to bring you around the lake as well. Just straight ahead of us is where you check in. I don't know if you can see it, but that's where you check in. So I'm going to see now, can I go around the lake? I'm gonna check now, see if I go around the lake. Yeah, here's your lake. Beautiful lake. You can go kayaking in, in it as well. So I'll take a quick cycle around there now. Just to show you what it is like. You can go fishing here as well. just take a short spin now around it. There's exercise machines as well. We saw a place where there was sheep yesterday. Um, that's nice. This is all part of the campsite, I think. But uh, yeah, nice fine big lakes. And there's where, where um, the kayaks are, so I presume people go kayaking here as well. And there's your area there for exercise bikes. And that, that's that there. Woo! Let's try and get out of here now. Jeez, I don't know how my tires to punch it. Uh, right, I'll try and go back to the campsite now. Nice play area there. Kind of groups and all that come here as well. God, it's a fine big area and the weather is so hot as well today. I 
and there's a, a walkway beyond this as well and you're only a few minutes 10 minutes walk into the town and only a five minute walk to the super you you know it's a nice place and I'll go back into the campsite and I'll go back down to my pitch but your chalet is here as well and you know it's great now back to back to our um, pitch now and we're lucky we're kind of right beside the water point I couldn't really see much water points around here but yeah and there we are again oh this is it now it's the campsite and all the pitches seem to have electric but not all of them have water but Johnny and Mossy are looking for what are them things in the ground you're looking for Moles. Very, very popular here for moles. Right. So that is it of the campsite. So we'll be back to you in a bit. Right, everyone. So that's it. Massey's underneath the camper van there somewhere looking for moles. So he is He's digging away over there. But um, that's it from the campsite. Uh, here in Brittany in Val de La Laundry or something it is but I'll have laundry yeah none of us are, are any good at uh, pronunciation of places but I'll have it all written below but um, yeah that's it from this campsite so uh, please th th give us a thumbs up subscribe to the channel and uh, share and hopefully you'll get to come to this campsite and let us know if you liked it and all that but as i said it's very near the village only 10 minute walk super view super you is a five minute walk and um and it's lovely and the weather is good so bye bye for now until next time bye bye